Welcome to my channel Dr. Munshi Nasser Skill Tone. How are you my dear learners? In this video I am going to discuss about how you can give or cite referencing in your research work smartly and properly. First tools that we are going to discuss about for referencing purpose is Zotero. Zotero in my opinion by far the best research and referencing tool for any publication or research article or thesis writing purposes. It is actually free, easy to use and it can collect, organize, cite and share your research. In order to download the Zotero, you just have to go zotero.org and then you go to the download option and you can download the file. Once you download the file, you have to just click the installation button and this will redirect you the file that you need which means Zotero setup. And once the Zotero setup is completed, you need to go to the Zotero and you can open the Zotero like this. The Zotero platform looks like this. It has a file option, it has an edit option, view option, tools option and as well as you can import anything that you want. For example, here import the files, import from clipboard, export library and lots of things. You also can create a folder. For example, in this case, I have created so many folders in my for my research purposes. So you can do the same thing using the Zotero. For instance, for this uh, video I am using a example of a renewable energy as a folder where I will upload some of the files here and I will I will show you with an example how to cite with Zotero now while downloading Zotero you need another two tools for Zotero one is called the Zotero connector so this is the tool that you need for your web browser Zotero connector so this web browser option will be hidden like this way here the reason why you need this is that it has a very nice way to collect the information from the website for instance if you would like to open a research article and you would like to cite it in your research all you have to do just open the Zotero connector and then you just have to collect I will show you in a while how to do that and you need to open the Zotero at the same time when you use the Zotero connector Installation of the Zotero connector is like for this way. You need to go to the Zotero.org download connectors and install the Zotero connector for Chrome. This is for Chrome. You can use for Firefox or Edge or any other browser purposes. All the browser will support the Zotero connector. Besides that, you can also use the word processor plugin installation from Zotero. All you have to do go zotero.org support word processor plugin installation. The reason why I'm saying that because once you have this word file and if you go to the referencing you will see there is always an option called the Zotero. You can see here the Zotero is an option in the word tab and this tab when you click this one you can see the add citation or add bibliography using Zotero Word Processor plugin. So I strongly recommend you to use this Zotero Word Processor plugin, download it, use it for your any Microsoft Word working file. So now I am going to show you how to use Zotero connector. For instance, once you download the Zotero this will be the Zotero platform so in order to use the Zotero connector you need to open first the Zotero platform in your computer and then let's for example renewable energy in Bangladesh current situation and future prospects so if you want to cite this paper in your research all you have to do go to Zotero connector as you can see here click this one and you see there is a folder renewable energy where I uploaded this file and this file is connected from the web browser to the my Zotero main file so if I open the Zotero now you will see renewable energy in Bangladesh renewable energy in Bangladesh current situation and future prospect this paper is already in my Zotero folder so you can see here how smartly Zotero connector can be useful for our research to in order to collect all the information from the web you do not need to collect the citation for instance here it says download citation you do not need the citation to download all you have to do use the Zotero connector open the Zotero folder and the Zotero connector will automatically 
collect all the information from the file and it will restore store in the folder that you have open for this particular research purposes so this is a fantastic way to cite your work and collect information from the web browser now my dear learners the another important tool that i would like to discuss today is the mendeley mendeley is a fantastic res res reference managing software or system where it is also parallelly good with the zotero all you have to do download the mendeley website if you click this one it will show you the mendeley referencing manager for desktop for 64 bit just click this one and it will download the zotero the mendeley file double click the Zot uh, the mendeley file and it will open the file and it looks like this okay so the mendeley desktop will look like this and i also create a folder renewable energy in the mendeley folder as well it has just like zotero like file it has import the information bip tax information and note information ris information it has edit view tools help everything so mendeley is just like zotero and also it has other features which you can share the work with your peers as well now mendeley does not have a very good way of collecting the information like zotero using mendeley connector web browser however you need to download the mendeley word processing file so in order to download installing citation plugin you have to go to the mendeley and you will see here in the tools you will see the uninstall ms word plugin so here you can go and see install web importer and also install word plugin since i already installed so it is says uninstalling ms word plugin but in your case you need to install ms word plugin from tools so go to tools install web importer install web ms word plugin for your computer once you install the word processing plugin go to the word and then you will see go to the referencing and you see insert citation the mendeley citation option and the open mendeley bar is already there in your word file so go to mendeley website i mean when mendeley web browser platform mendeley desktop that you have already downloaded the software go to the tools and then install web importer and install ms word plugin that's it you need all these two things to in order to use it in mendeley directly in your word file another good platform is the microsoft academic this is a very good platform like google scholar you can select the timeline for your data collection i mean the research article or literature review purpose and now i selected it my title of the research is renewable energy and sustainable development in thailand so i search it and you can see many of the papers during this time period are already here there are many other way you can use microsoft academic i have a full video on microsoft academic and i request you to look at the microsoft academic platform it's a very nice platform for collecting your literature review for free and here i would like to show you one of the very good option of microsoft academic where you can see the double dot version and here you can easily click this one and you see the citation list so this is the paper that we would like to cite and microsoft academic will give you the option like mla apa chicago so all you have to do let's say i would like to choose the api style and download microsoft word or bip text or ris so if i would download the bip text option it will download the bip text here and if i just click this file this will open with the microsoft bip text option in the zotero directly so you can see here that the role of renewable energy source in environmental protection and review this paper is already in my zotero option how nice is that right my dear learners so all you have to do go to the microsoft academics and go to this citation again and i'll show you if you have this new citation api citation download the bip text file now again you just have to go and download it the topic of the title is optimum use of power to gas energy storage click it and okay and this will import the new file in our zotero platform optimum use of power to gas energy storage system so you can see if you open up the zotero and download the citation from the microsoft academic and double click the bip text file it will directly go to the zotero folder that you have created and this file is already there in your zotero folder so you can use this 
a paper citation in your research work now we are going to show you how you can use it in your research work using zotero and mendeley reference managing system now let's assume that this is our research of uh, the sustainable development of renewable energy in thailand and the motivation of this research is renewable energy is a non-polluting source of energy this is this carbon free technology aids in the fight against climate change and has emerged as a vi visible alternative to today's uh, petrochemical energy sources so if i would like to give a citation here for instance okay all you have to do if you have a zotero let's say zotero and click the citation and zotero will ask you first which citation style you want so here lot of citation style here harvard apa lots of i mean there are many other many options are here so you can choose anything so first you can choose the uh, american psychological association option and you click this one okay and there is a box come up so now if you just say renewable okay so there you see a lot of options coming up for instance if i just choose this paper i'm just randomly choosing and then click this one you see here that this citation is already inserted in here from the zotero remember my dear learner you need to open the zotero all all the time when you are citing referencing inside your research now my dear learners we would like to see how the mendeley referencing manager works you have to open the mendeley desktop website and then let's say here also i would like to insert a mendeley referencing all you have to do go referencing and then you go to the insert citation there is a box all you have to do just say renewable let's assume that we would like to say renewable here and you can pick any 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 of the research let's say for for the example i would like to use this one and press ok and here you see the referencing is already there now the mendeley is a very nice way to insert the uh, bibliography option all you have to do press the cursor here insert bibliography and you see the referencing is already there for a glimpse of eye it's a very nice and the same goes for zotero as well now if i would like to add the bibliography using zotero click zotero add citation again and let's assume that i use renewable energy this one and then i added any added the in text citation here and then at the end let's say here i would like to cite the bibliography add the bibliography you see the bibliography of the incited referencing are already there in my research file so this way you can collect the information from the web or upload any of the information using the zotero go to the select the file that you would like folder that you would like to import the file go to the file option and then import file now you can import bib text ris rdf everything or you can also import mendeley information in zotero as well and also there is another option called just you just need to uh, minimize it and then if you'd like to add any for example this 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 uh, pdf just drag and drop and it will automatically uh, come up in in the in the in the zotero platform just drag the pdf drop it in your folder and it will automatically come up here in this folder where you are putting all the referencing in the list so you can easily cite from this particular folder dragging the pdf that you already downloaded or using zotero connector to collect the web browser information using here collect the zotero platform and in take the all the information that you need either way you can collect all the information in this particular folder so my dear learners today's main topic is to introduce you two most important referencing managing software one is mendeley desktop other one is a zotero using zotero connector and word plugin and using mendeley word plugin and word plugin and importer of the web importer plugin you can collect all the information of the referencing very easily and also i will show i showed you the microsoft academic using the referencing download the bib text file and then this bib text file can be uploaded to zotero or mendeley very easily so these are the three important things that i would like to share in today's video i hope this video is useful for your research and in, if it is useful for you, do subscribe my channel and I will see you in the next tutorial. Thank you so much my dear learners. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.